you so much for joining my mom and I on our quick day trip up to Amador County. Amador County is slowly opening in California and we just needed to take a ride to see what was happening. Along the way, we stopped at a local cherry farm. We actually, the whole reason for this ride was actually to hand pick some cherries, but unfortunately they had no you pick stands open. So we stopped alongside a, a really cute, very small cherry farm. Um, we actually got to talk to the guy who ran it and he didn't use any pesticides on his cherries. We also got a couple of nectarines. They were absolutely beautiful and super delicious. So we just could not pass them up. From the little cherry stand, mom and I headed up the road about 10 minutes to Lockford. Lockford's a very small town, but they have a very, very popular meat market. And that's exactly what you guys are gonna be able to see in the next clip. I totally wouldn't be surprised if some of you already knew about Lockford uh, Meat Service because they are so popular. Every single time we come here on the weekend, the line is wrapped around the building, headed out the back. So we, uh, my mom and I got super lucky. We only had to wait maybe about 30 minutes in line. Um, they're only currently allowing three people in at a time due to COVID-19 and social distancing. They ask before you enter to, of course, hand sanitize, wear a mask. Um, and then again, three people in at one time. But I just kind of want to show you guys what they all offered. They have a huge select selection of sausages. Um, they have pre-marinated tri-tips. They have jerky. They have um, meat sticks as well that are a great quick little protein snack that you can take with you. Um, I got an insane amount of sausage. I think I got like seven, seven different sausages. I ended up getting pesto sausage, the Hawaiian luau's, which are huge, the Portuguese linguiça, which was absolutely amazing. Um, a sausage called bacon sausage, which was freaking delicious. Um, it's a great breakfast sausage. I also got a pound of bacon. You can see them laying out the bacon right there. Um, and then actually grabbing my pound of bacon was uh, very good. And then I got a couple of different jerkies. I got teriyaki jerky and regular jerky, as well as um, lamb jagger sticks and teriyaki sticks, which were equally, equally delicious. My mom and I had to go buy a cooler from the, the supermarket next door after this. You did. I got... Um, in sausages, I got a smoky bratwurst, I got uh -huh. a bacon, Yeah. I got a hot beer sausage, yeah. I got the spicy luau sausage, I think that's going to be good. It's so good. I got the Cajun. That one's spicy too, right? Yeah. Yeah. I got the linguiça. Mm. Uh, Oh, the oaky sausages. Oh, the small breakfast Yes, ones. the breakfast sausages look good. Yum. And then I got a, a tri marinated tri-tip. Tri From Lockford, we decided to head up to the small town of Jackson, which is in Amador County. While we were in Jackson, we honestly just wanted to sh see what a um, slowly opening town looks like. Um, now this is a very small town with lots of mom and pop shops. Um, as you can see right straight ahead is the National Hotel and that is a beautiful hotel right in the middle of downtown Jackson. It gives a little insight of what the hotel used to be which was the Louisiana House and it changed the name in um, the 1800s to the National Hotel. It has a steakhouse on the bottom and then up these stairs is the way into the lobby. It is a beautiful hotel if you ever wanted to get away somewhere. Um, a lot of these small local businesses were still closed. It was a Tuesday, so they probably are trying to open on the weekends because it's going to be naturally just a little bit busier. Um, but during the weekday, it looked like some of these small mom and pop shops were still uh, closed.
One thing mom and I did notice with every, every store, every business is that it said you must wear a mask. This is an example of a sign that was outside of the restaurant downtown. Um, but even though some stores were closed, about about four or five were open. Um, I love seeing little open stores. There were a couple of people just going in and out. This was the local candy store downtown. Unfortunately, I didn't get to film inside. There was no filming allowed, but it is a beautiful candy store. Um, definitely check it out. candy store we made our way to the biggest little kitchen store and if I could pick one store to shop when I came to Jackson this would be it it has absolutely everything you need for your kitchen and your home and it is beautiful After mom and I did a little bit of shopping, we decided to grab a bite to eat at the Highway House in Jackson. And this is the first time we've eaten inside of a restaurant since the shelter in place. being able to have a gin and tonic in a restaurant. Oh my god, it's like heaven. I know. Mm. I'm never going to take this for granted again. So after mom and I had a very yummy lunch at the Highway House, we decided it was time to head home from our fun-filled day. So we just made it home, and we have the moments from the day. We got cherries, super yummy. Yeah, we got a cup that says Big Daddy because Big Daddy, and then we got saltwater taffy, some super cool uh, chocolate bars that are like all weird different flavors. Then we have our sausages and all the meats that we got today oh my god it looks so good that was it you guys thank you so much for watching our very first youtube video and if you like click that subscribe button to stay tuned for more